people be here in about 15 minutes, so feel free to talk, mingle, have some fun, like a toilet little glass of wine. Love you lots. Thank you. Good evening, it's, it's Lauren and, and Dad. Uh, we have a, uh, a trade fair coming up if you'd like to come along. Uh, it's going to be on the 15th of November with Nicola Musgrove from uh, Harmon Innovation Centre and also runs Cullum Innovation Centre. It's a great chance to promote your thing. It's going to be a specific one. We've now taken the thing, we're going to go with it's going to be an IT trade fair. Uh, we've also got one, what have we got, Lauren? <laughs> an eco trade fair with here at Ben Jackson. We're looking at a date, but uh, we will let you know, but we're looking at about the 24th of October. It's gonna be an eco-sustainable, helping companies grow thoroughly uh, eco, so eco solar power companies, um, green companies, asbestos removal companies, anything to the green, lighting companies. Uh, and it's gonna be, we're starting to move into specific trade fairs, specific sectors where we're focusing and honing it down and changing what we do in a, in a small way. Thank you. Okay, final thing. Um, how do people find out more? Website. Right, you People can find out more by speaking to Lauren. <laughs> uh, tell them. I'll do it. I'll well, do, we'll do that. Do that again. I'll, I'll, I'll do this one. Yeah, yeah. I love I'll you doing it. No, Go on. No, I'll, I'll, I'll add her into it a little bit. Please, right. please let her do it. I'll, I'll, I'll add her into it. I'll, I'll add her into a little bit. Ready? I don't like it. Let's okay. Contact details. Right. right. You can find us on www.advocatesevents.group.co.uk, or you can call us on 079 760 uh, or find us on Twitter, Facebook, and LinkedIn. And we would love you to come and help us and help you grow your companies. Thank you. It's Abigail Spence. We've got a trade fair here today in Vista. We're really humbled to be doing something for Vista Chamber of Commerce. This is what we're doing. It's a trade fair for Vista Chamber of Commerce, promoting the town. Every town we go into, whether it be Abingdon, Whitney, Swindon, Newbury, we're very proud of the people in the town and the businesses in it. And we're all about promoting businesses all day long. We've had a breakfast meeting here with my daughter. This is Lauren, she's the face of Abacus Events. If you get an email and you want to unsubscribe, this is the person. <laughs> uh, basically, we're really proud of what, what we do. So we have trade fairs, you'll hear some noise in the background. We have 20 stands here, we've got about 60 people in the room. We're having speakers and we're trying to put something back in the community. In the fact that we're trying to bring business together. Uh, Lauren and I run breakfast meetings in different towns. We want to have one in every single town. And, and what, our, what our meetings are about is you don't need membership for, to come to our meetings. You can come and go if you please. And what we're really, really impressed with 
is we're raising money tonight for charity. This sound is money raised for the Oxia Play Bus. Tonight we'll shake our tin hearts. We've raised thousands of pounds in the last couple of months for charities, whether it be Helen and Douglas, Sue Ryder, Action Against Breast Cancer, Prostate Cancer, Wantage Counseling Services, Catherine House Hospice, and tonight the Play Bus Family Young Home is the main of a few. We're very passionate about that. Thank you. Um, that's really good. What I'd like you to do now is uh, explain, just say it's been a yeah. great day and when the next one is. That's nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. right. Okay. Left, right. Right. Our next trade fair, which, which we'd love to see you out, either you can book a stand, we can go on our magazine, Stronpro, it will be an eco trade fair with Ben Jackson in Bista. We're also doing one on the 15th of November with uh, Claire from the Nick. <laughs> Are we off? Hi, I'm Jackie Jarvis from Marketing Co and I've got with me here Jamie from Abacus Events. Good evening. And um, we're here at the charity networking barbecue that I've planned for the 2nd of August and we're just about waiting for people to start arriving. We've got nearly a hundred guests arriving tonight so I'm really excited, aren't you Jamie? Uh, so am I and I've got my hammer. <laughs> I am the auctioneer. Yeah, so we're, we're doing a charity auction this evening for um, the British Heart Foundation and we're hoping to raise as much as we possibly can. We've got £6,000 worth of auction items, haven't yeah, we? Yeah, I mean, we're, we're really pleased. I, I met Jackie some time ago and what I do know about Jackie, she's one of those people that truly makes it happen. So look here tonight, this is all courtesy of Jackie Jarvis. Uh, we're going to raise £6,000. We've got £6,000 worth of prizes. Let's hope we raise the 6000 and give it to a wonderful cause. There's a huge list of kind people who have donated prizes to us. Testament to Jackie and what she is, does as a business. Oh, that's very sweet of you. Business, ladies and gentlemen, to take them on that golf course. Who's going to give me £120? If not, we're going to stop it at £100. £120 of the gorgeous blonde lady with a black and white crazy top. Go on, Adam, you're a very lucky man sitting there, said lady. Who's going to give me £140, ladies and gentlemen? £140. It's only £140. You must have somebody, lover, wife, friend, or family wants to play this. Golf, no? Okay. Right, I think we should stop it there and give it to the lady. Right, done. He gets my hammer. This, ladies and gentlemen, was in a, a factory tonight, and I dropped the edits of meat and hammer, and... That is sold, ladies and gentlemen. Go on to the lady over there. Please give her a prize. Thank you very much. Right. This, this is this is me. Forty pounds for a fifty-seven pounds in Jackie Jarvis's house treatment. It's bound to. Will the treatment be going on in there? Because it probably is. Because everything else is. Forty-five pounds. Forty-five pounds. Forty-five pounds. Fifty pounds. Fifty pounds. Come on. The lawyer's in the house tonight. The lawyer is in the house. 50 pounds for the lawyer. Would you want? <laughs> Shall I do the next oh, yeah, one? <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, I am absolutely unbelievably privileged to have my fishing and friend, good friend, Mr. Taylor in here. Right, Clive and I fish for the years. This man knows nothing about, he was the Oxford Mail Angling Times columnist writer. There's nothing he doesn't know about a water course, ladies and gentlemen. He knows all the birds, he knows the bees, you will see voles, lesser spotted beekeepers, and every single, he will tell you every single duck on the river. You will spend a half day with him, the Clyde David Turtle Credit Management, who will sell swords, your total credit problems, and will teach you how to paddle your kayak, and you can take on your wonderful journey along the ISIS. How deep is that, Clive? Is it quite deep? 2.5 meters. Will they find crayfish and critters in there? Where you will enjoy a beautiful historic Oxford. Will they go past the colleges? Underneath the colleges, through college grounds, and get a nice lunch thrown in as well. Do you want to say something about it? No. Right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <shut up. laughs> joking. Right. Mr. Taylor has come back from the Alps. Have you, Clive, for kayaking? This guy is hardcore. You'll probably see him on Sky soon. Hardcore Clive kayaking. 
He also does soft kayaking, which takes time, or you can do rapids with him in weirs. I've experienced his expert skill, right? Who's going to start me off for 40 pounds for this event? 40 pounds to have a lovely time. It's got to be worth that to see the undisturbed Thames, Isis, and the college. A man to my right, a hardcore man, 40 pounds. Who's going to be 45 pounds to go with Total Credit Management Clyde kayaking on a wonderful day out in his boats? Will they have a boat each or will you be sharing a boat? 45 pounds. Will, will they be sharing a boat or a boat each? If it's ladies, it'll be two of you in there. And if it's a man, it'll be a boat each. There you go. Uh, 50 pounds. 50 pounds. We're going to 50 pounds. We have a ladies bid, 45 pounds, wants to join the tandem boat with Clive. You won't get your hair wet. You won't get your hair wet. Will they get their hair wet, Clive? You're not going through any rapids. What about the lady to right? She's looking interested. You're going to give me 50 pounds. 50 pounds. He's obviously worked on you tonight. <laughs> He's worked his Clive magic. Who's going to give me 55 pounds to go with Clive Taylor and you can talk debt collection through the ages <laughs> while you're in the boat and he'll even bring you some sandwiches. He's just her 55 pounds. 55 pounds. He's attracting all the ladies. Come on, 60 pounds. I think this is a wonderful gift. For, you can even wrap it up. Can they have it for Christmas? Can they go in the ice? Whatever you like. 55 pounds. 55 pounds to go on this wonderful, wonderful kayak with Mr. Taylor. Will they get any wine? Will you be parking up on a little field somewhere? Just special. To show them, obviously, to show them obviously the pipe, pipers and twitterers, tweeters. Right, okay, 55 pounds gone to lady on my right. You're with Clive, God help you. <laughs> Um, we may try and get the bar. The bar seems to have died. I was supposed to have stay open. Yeah. Um, we're nearly coming to the end, so no worries. There's just there's a few people going. We're gonna, we've just got three more to go, and we have got raffle tickets um, still to go. Um, the next one is half a half day rowing experience with an expert rowing coach. Is it No. It's a Paul Franklin. He's a he's a, he's a rowing coach. He's another friend of mine. <laughs> I've actually been rowing with him as well for a day, and um, I wasn't very good at it actually, it wasn't really my thing, but um, he's really good, and he, he will take you out for a um, morning's rowing, half day rowing experience along the Thames from the Eton Excelsior Rowing Club. So if you've ever fancied doing some rowing or seeing whether you like it or going out for the day, then he's offered that for a half a day. It'd be a fantastic half day, especially if the sun shines. So anytime you like, be weekend or during the week, um, so, um, yeah, that's it really. We put a value of 180 on it, but hey, you know, um, if you'd enjoy that day out, I'm sure I'd be happy to take you. Right, ladies and gentlemen, the, the thing I'm getting really scared of now is if you go rowing, how far is this from the ISIS, Clive? You might bang into Clive in his kayak. <laughs> <laughs> you can go faster than Clive. Can, they, can a rower go faster than you? Yeah. yeah, right, okay, perfect. Isn't that better? <laughs> Beat Clive and the lady in his canoe. Right, half day rowing experience, expert rowing coach, Paul Franklin is offering an opportunity to find out how you could end up in the Olympics. Take up rowing, I should experience it. He'll take you to the next level, time you finish you'll want to row everywhere. You'll just want to row to work. He will take you out for a full half day on the Thames from Eton. Excelsior Rowing Club sounds very expensive. Right, value 180, I think we're going to go for 90 pounds. 90 pounds for a rowing. 90 pounds a half day experience rowing in the Eton Excelsior Rowing Club on the Thames with oars <laughs> with a wooden boat of some sort. What, what about 50 pounds? Come on, let's start this off. 50 pounds to go rowing. Rowing? I know it's late. I, I know you're all feeling a bit tired. But 50 pounds on a Saturday morning you go rowing with this man. 50 pounds. Come on. Did somebody just move their hand? 50 pounds. 50, 40 pounds. 40 pounds to go rowing. This man wants to go rowing. Look, super fit. 50 pounds for a rowing adventure. Did you just move? 50 pounds, sir. 50 pounds. 60 pounds for a rowing adventure. Don't forget, you do not have to use this yourself. You can give it to some rowing fanatic. You will probably run over some swans and maybe scare off some ducks. No. Going to the man on the right. Going, going, gone. Thank you. I think the value is 250. Right, ladies and gentlemen, as Jackie said, for, for the 
four ball, round the goal, two across, and there's like Ho Chi Minh Chao here. <laughs> Good morning, Vietnam. Uh, right, ladies and gentlemen, right, this is valued at 250 pounds, only 250 pounds. Four rolls round of golf, two course lunch, beautiful chipping on. Who would want to be anywhere else? Uh, who's going to give me 150 pounds for this wonderful prize? There must be some golfers in here tonight. Right, let's start a bit lower. Who's going to give me 100 pounds? Come on, ladies and gentlemen. I will. It's 100. What a kind man over there. Look at that, that open doors table, Jackie. Ooh. That's your 100 quid, though. <laughs> right, 100 pounds. Who's going to give me 120 pounds? Come on, 120 pounds. For this wonderful, wonderful thing donated by Dark and Taylor. Who's going to give me 120 pounds? If not, we're going to stop it at 100 pounds. 120 pounds of the gorgeous blonde lady with a black and white stripy top. Go on, Adam, you're a very lucky man, selling that set lady. Who's going to give me 140 pounds, ladies and gentlemen? 140 pounds. It's only 140 pounds. You must have somebody, lover, wife, friend, or family wants to play this. Golf, no? Okay. Right, I think we should stop it there and give it to the lady. Right, done. He gets my hammer. This lady, and gentlemen, was in a, a factory tonight and I dropped the end. It's a meat hammer and that is sold, ladies and gentlemen. Gone to the lady over there. Please give her a prize. Thank you very much. <laughs>